welcome back to my channel thank you for taking the time every day to stop back on my channel all right guys this is the last day of 2019 I cannot believe this year has gone by so so quickly um, I I'm not doing much for for New Year's Eve. We're not doing much. We're staying home. I hope that you guys all have a wonderful, wonderful New Year's Eve and enjoy yourself. But be safe out there, guys. Be safe. It's been snowing here um, for over 24 hours. So we have a ton of snow. Not that I'm complaining. I love snow. We don't have anywhere to go. So we're nice and safe. We're in the house. Um, Stefano is taking a nap right now. He would have made of an appearance, but we're going to try to put up a a quick video maybe do a little live video tonight so we can say happy new year's to everybody and thank everybody for joining us in this wonderful year we didn't quite make it to 10,000 subscribers but you know there's always next year right I'm not I'm looking forward to what next year is going to bring there's a lot of changes there's some changes very dramatic changes that we're excited about and afraid we're kind of scared and nervous um, I will be telling you that at the end of the month um, it is a very life-changing for Stefano and I and um, we're a little nervous to share it but we will be sharing um, so yeah it's, it's going to be a lot of changes this year. Um, I'm going to have to be a very strong person this year, and I know I will, but um, you'll know more at the end of the month. I'm sorry to hold it back from you, by, but we um, need some time to figure out things and adjust things so that we can let you guys know. I feel like all discombobulated right now. Um, so, yes, so 2.30 in the morning, we had to get up out of bed. It has been snowing for a very long time. Sometimes heavy, sometimes light, sometimes a mix of both, and then some sleet on top, so we had ice. Um, so you know that we have cats that live under our house and there's a little hole that they had made. Actually, Stefano had broke it when he was fixing underneath our trailer one time, he broke it. And um, so they found a way in. So that's how they get in. Well, with all the snow and everything, it has been just crazy out here with all this snow. So um, I guess they got it kind of scared and they tried to break out. And so I figured it was getting covered, so we had to dig out. So we dug them out. We dug our stars out. We couldn't even open our front door. That's how much snow was here. It was t it was just crazy. So and it's still snowing right now. So yeah. Well, without further ado, guys, I know you don't want to hear anything um, about keto. I am going to be doing a wrap up 2019 keto journey with you guys. Get down and deep about my keto so you guys can know about my keto. Um, so this is my last haul of 2019 last one and it's a good one let me tell you you know guys I've been so disappointed in my Dollar Trees we just we didn't get any of that cool stuff that you guys got so what I did grab I was lucky to get but I do have all new stuff to share with you guys I have three bags not very full but three bags so let's just get started I'm gonna grab this one over here sorry for the crinkling I know you guys don't like it you guys all know that it is the beginning of the year so what do they do in January it is always health related always organization related always you know that brand new starts clean your house do all kinds of stuff so look at this these are some new storage containers that they have now I do have a, I'm, a, I'm a card maker I love making my cards so I will be going back to grab a, a bunch more of these but these are perfect for my my dies my thin metal dies that I have this is a very nice size it's convenient it's stackable they have different colors of them I think I have a picture of it but yeah I really do like this one it's um, easy peel label oh, that's what they say it says teacher teaching tree it's they have it right in the beginning like if you go to Lewiston um, Dollar Tree they have it right in the beginning the second aisle over in the front of the store so but they have a whole bunch of stuff I mean a lot of stuff I have pictures we also did a little walkthrough so um, you guys could see we didn't quite get anything new for Valentine's Day though that's disappointing so that is something new they also have a uh, half off of all of their Christmas stuff. I didn't see these when they were out, so I was lucky enough to find one. It's a little sequin pillow. It is a little, you know, a little stocking. Very, very cute. I thought it was super, super cute. So I grabbed it for 50 cents. And they had this, um, we're actually gonna try this tonight with some pork rinds. This is Dippin', it's roasted red pepper artichoke bruschetta. 
and actually the, the in the back for two tablespoons of it it is uh, just one net carb but if you're counting total carbs there's two total carbs in here and one gram of sugar but what are you gonna do I mean that's great for Dollar Tree right and there's a lot in here it's 10 ounces that's a lot so you just heat and serve very very fun we're having that tonight for New Year's and I found these I'm not too keen on carb cutters. I will actually talk more about that in depth with my wrapping up keto 2019 video, but these are uh, slim fast boosters. They're carb cutters. Cheat carbs on your diet without quitting your weight loss plan. It's filled with green extract, green tea extract. And you guys know I did do a thing on my haul about green tea and how beneficial green tea is and helping you. So, um, there is 105 capsules. They also had some fat blockers, which I really don't believe in fat blockers. And I really don't, I'm iffy on these. A lot of people say about carb blockers, that they're great, whatever. Um, this is carb cutter. So, and it's a new product. And so I did grab two boxes just to see if they work. They also had some gummy bears, but the carbs on them were 37 carbs on them. So that's not cutting no carbs for me. So yes, so that is one bag. And then, excuse me for bending over guys. I do have some things in here from Walmart I got on sale. I'll share them with you. Oh, I have to share this. Now I have a ton, <laughs> ton of these. Who doesn't have a ton of these? But this is my favorite one. I wanna get the one in mint green. Um, and they also have it in gray. It just says love on it. I will open you. this. It is 11 inches across um, and 10 and a half inches high. So it is really, really pretty. It, I think it's a little bit bigger than the ones I got for Christmas with the plaid. The plaid, I think they are a little bit bigger. They are much deeper. So, but these are really pretty. Very, very, look how big that is. That's huge. That really is big. So I love this one and they have all different styles. I will show you a picture of them. Of course I took a picture, but I only got one. I don't need a lot cause I have a ton of these. Um, but that is going to be good for my crafting section. Excuse me again, guys. I apologize. All right. And oh man, I was so excited. I collect all of these. They had home, family, and friend. I got this silver one home. I'm gonna put it in my little in my little octagon things over there uh, on those shelves. I love this. So I did get the home one. And then I did pick up these scarves. Now, these are really, really cute. You know what I'm gonna do with these? I'm gonna make myself another one of those swags that I made, and I have a video on how I made it. But I thought the tassels at the end were adorable. But look at this cute little heart. I mean, that is really cute. That is really cute. I am more like the Infinity Girl. I love the Infinity scarves. They are my absolute favorite. I have my favorite scarf from Hobby Lobby that I got years ago. I love that thing. So, yep. Yeah, so this is really cute. I mean, it is cute. I did pick up four of them. I did pick up four of them to make my um, my farmhouse little uh, window swag. I love those. I make them all the time. They're great for everything. Halloween, Valentine's Day, Christmas, birthdays, and just to have on your window real pretty ones. Got myself some more of the crafter squares because these are only 16 in here. I'm really not thinking that they are the best deal for me. I'm actually gonna buy a huge pack at Hobby Lobby coming up soon, uh, but I don't like running out. I got these magical, magical page markers. These are for my cookbooks. I have a whole ton of cookbooks, keto cookbooks, so I wanna have these for that. So I know it's a little bit early for, um, for Easter decor, but come on, when you see it, you gotta pick it up because it's gonna be gone, girl, gone. So look at this. These are some metal letters, metal words, I'm sorry. And it says, Spring Bunny Welcome. So I, I cannot wait to use these on some cool signs that I will be doing. And I found some more of the silver wired LED lights. I, you can't go wrong with these. I use these a ton in a lot of my projects, so I got them. And then I looked everywhere last year for these two items. Like it drove me crazy. These 
could not find them. I did only pick up one because I believe last year, I had to look at my Easter stuff, but I believe I found them after Easter. So I only picked up one of them and they're the four pack and it's the carrots, very, very cute. And these, I could not find these anywhere last year. So I did find them. I only picked up one again because I was kind of tight on a tight budget. So if I go back and they're still there, I will pick up more of them. But these little Easter eggs, speckled eggs are the cutest, especially for that farmhouse decor. Oh, very cute. And then I got some clip um, clips for, uh, you know, for chip clips, what they call them. But I use these a lot in my kitchen and I couldn't resist, but these ones, these were new. And they had little puppies too. So I got the little kitty cats, but they were amazingly cute. I thought they were so cute. I couldn't resist. All right, guys. So I was super lucky. I was going to order online the little fairy set, but I waited. And I went to only one of my Dollar Trees had them. One. So I got the little fairy. They had a mix of the fairy from last year, fairy garden from last year, and they had the new stuff this year. So I did pick up quite a few pieces. First off, I got the base. They had this and they had a green square one, like with uh, the grass. So I did pick up this one. This looks like the top of a cake, doesn't it? Very, very cute. I'm putting these out for Valentine's Day. I did pick up this little table. It's a little ice cream cone table set for that. And then I got myself, I will show you, hold on. Hold please. And then I got myself, look how cute that is. Is that not the cutest? It is stinking adorable. Um, they are plastic. They do feel plasticky to me. Um, but they're solid. They're not that flimsy plastic. They're really solid. But look at that one. That is the cutest. I love it. And the glitter. Love glitter. Um, and then this one says sweet. And it's it looks like a um, this is it looks like a um, ice cream cone or a waffle cone, doesn't it? Very very cute. Adore. These are so stinking cute. And then I couldn't resist, but I did get the camper. This is an ice cream. It says ice cream on it. That is the cutest. Now this doesn't have a lot of glitter, so I might actually take the top and glitter the top and down here, you know, I might glitter that in a little ice cream. I'm gonna glitter that up. And then um, I got the little gazebo. Again, this doesn't have a lot of glitter on it, so I will glitter this up. Now they did have like a little lollipop trail kind of going, like little pop lollipops. So I'm gonna pick them up if they're still there. I thought they were adorable. And I didn't go too crazy. They were the only things that I really did get um, building wise because they're gonna go on my mantle for, for Valentine's Day. I thought it would be so cute over there. So what really got me was the unicorns. I love the unicorns. They are stinking adorable. Um, I did pick up these little gnomes. Now they're holding ice creams and lollipops. Again, I was thinking about taking where the little lollipops are, um, just glittering them up a little bit so that they would match everything. And then I only picked up this one. It's like little like balloons or little signs. And it's a heart, lollipops, and some flowers. Again, I was thinking about going and getting that and glittering that up a little bit. Okay, guys, that is the end of my 2019 Dollar Tree hauls. Thank you so much, guys, for supporting my channel. Thank you so much for all the wonderful comments. Again, thank you. Thank you so much for all the love and the support that you've given me. I can't believe how many subscribers, new subscribers I got. Hello, thank you so much. And you beautiful ladies that sent me cards. I just got the last five in. I've already sent out my cards to thank everybody for the, for the cards that I got. If you want to see those cards, please let me know. I will be more than happy to do a video. I normally don't do videos on Happy Mail because I think it's a personal between you and I. And I love to say send you thank yous and all. All right, guys. So thank you so much for always stopping by, always giving me your support, your love, your kind words. I really do appreciate it. You guys know that we had a kind of a terrible year this year with the passing of my grandmother, the passing of my dog, Mia. My She's my baby. 
baby. She was my everything. She was always here with me. Um, Stormy is here somewhere here. She's sleeping. She's over there sleeping. Um, and thank you so much for giving her all your love that you guys give her. And we really appreciate it. Um, you know, Stefano lost his cat Kiki this year. We had just a tough year with losses. And we had some kind of bad news with his uh, father with health um, issues and still Stefano has not said if I could say anything I'll ask him maybe we'll talk about it tonight all right guys thank you from the bottom of my heart thank you thank you for a great 2019 and hopefully we continue continue all this amazingness in 2020 so please join me for my next video whenever that might be which will probably be tonight so thank you so much and happy new year everybody thank you thank you thank you and i will be seeing you all like i always say somehow some way i'll have an amazing day you make your day amazing and together friends we'll have an amazing day i'll see you in my next video Mwah. bye guys <laughs>